Hey guys, Lucky HD here, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, quite possibly one of the most insane Lumion Legacy mess ups happened today. And it, it made a lot of people upset, a lot of people confused, and in this video, we're just going to be going over it. If you guys do enjoy this video, go to the like, subscribe, and let's get straight into it. Alrighty, so yesterday, Lumion Legacy put out a new event inside of the game, and it was the Luminity Park event, and inside of this, it introduced a new Lumion line. And this new Lumion line, the first evolution, was named Cicaloot. Cicaloot is kind of like this musical cicada type of thing, since cicadas obviously are very noisy it's i guess you know correlated with an instrument in this case and the design you know it looks kind of cool and around i believe level 29 it'll start to evolve into violata now violata continues this theme of being a cicada you know playing the music and all that stuff with its shell now being like a violin hence the viol part like as in violin and yeah i mean overall it's a pretty you know cool design a pretty cool take on a cicada that plays music and a lot of people were upset by this and you might be thinking, well, look at HD. How could they be upset by a cicada playing uh, an instrument, right? And surely that's just silly, right? Well, they were more upset when it came to the name of this Lumion. Now, heading over to our good old Google Translate over here, if you go from Spanish to English, you know, Spanish, one of the most popular, uh, uh, you know, of foreign languages, I guess you could say, uh, we, we could type in Violada right here. And you you can start to see how, uh, yeah. And what's even worse in this case, if you flip this around, it actually is the feminine version of this word. So, basically, it is the... <sighs> Violata translates to a woman who has been violated. Now, considering the fact that LTS is mainly comprised of, you know, a bunch of white people that don't really speak any other language, that's not to say all of them, obviously, but as to my knowledge, there is nobody on the team that speaks Spanish. So, you know, something like this would have been really easy to kind of oversight, especially considering the fact that, you know, when you're a creature capturing designer or, you know, somebody who just comes up with the names and stuff like that, like, it is very easy to see this as an oversight. I mean, you know, personally, Whenever I'm making a name for a creature, I literally, you know, take two, three words, whatever I'm making a name for, put them together, and after I'm, you know, happy with it, I don't really go out of my way to go to, like, a translator and be like, ah, oh, well, what does this name mean in this other language? It seems to have just been an unfortunate set of circumstances that led to nobody, again, checking if this name actually meant something else, because, again, nobody on the team speaks Spanish. And it actually seems the original designer of this Lumion, which was Yolo's, ironically, one of the people who is not white on the team, ended up making this Lumion, and they weren't even the one that decided the name on it. Apparently, that was off to somebody else. And from what I've heard, this is a very common case with a lot of Lumions, where the Lumion's name is actually just decided by other people and not the designers themselves, which I think is a little odd, and I think the designers should actually have the responsibility, in my opinion, of creating the names, looking into it, and all that stuff. Now, people were not happy with Lumion Legacy at all for doing this, and, I mean, you know, I say for doing Doing this like they intended to do it which they didn't but you know people were sitting there and again they were super upset by this entire thing and Lumion Legacy actually just ended up changing the name to instead of Violata or Violata to now Violana so prob problem solved so yeah obviously the entire thing has since been resolved but it is definitely a wild footnote in this current year of Lumion Legacy Definitely the last thing that I expected to happen with an update like this, or just a Lumion in general. But yeah, it seems the developers, you know, obviously have kind of taken it lightly and stuff like that. Going out on Twitter and making jokes about it. So let me know down in the comments below, you know, what are your entire thoughts about this situation? Again, put them down in the comments below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.